Hey everyone, this is Phantom back with another Linux tutorial and in this video I'm gonna be showing you how to connect your Android phone with your KDE Plasma desktop and using the KDE Connect you can transfer files from phone to your desktop or desktop to your phone and there are some other cool stuff that you can do and I'm gonna show you in a minute so software grab your phone and head over to the Play Store and here search for KDE connect this is the one and just simply install it now I have already done it open now head over to your desktop and here go to system tray and go to KD connect and pair a device so for this to work you have to connect your desktop and your phone to the same Wi-Fi so you have done that then you'll be able to see your desktop's name over here so Mine is Phantom PC, so I'm gonna select that and request Perry. And as you can see, that there is a pop up over here, so I'm gonna click on accept. And as you can see now, that on my phone here, you will see all these options. So from here, you can tap on remote input and as you can see if I basically I can use it as a touchpad cursor is moving and if you double tap it's gonna right click on your desktop single tap basically you can use it as a touchpad now now there are some other options and such as you can send files here if you click on send files and you can just select any file you want to send and let's say oh uh, maybe let's say this one and as you can see if i go to the downloads and here is my picture that i just sent so you can send files from your phone to your desktop by using the send files option and there's some other as well you can control the multimedia uh, player on your desktop and you can run command and there's some other stuff here that you can try and if you want to send something uh, to your phone from your desktop you can go here where is KD? so I cannot seem to find the KD connect here so I'm going to search for it Alright, so from here you can select the share file option. Alright, so if you go to KD Connect and choose your device here, you can choose the share file option and you can share any, uh, select any file from here and share it and this will be available on your phone. So that is basically it guys. This was a very short tutorial and I will see you in the next video and help me out guys. I'm trying to reach a ton of subscribers so help your brother out. So I will see you in the next video and thank you for your support. I really appreciate that and I will see you in the next video guys. And also the one more thing that is if you wanna know how I customize this desktop, I make a lot of customization videos then uh, make sure to follow and subscribe and uh, i'll be uploading the customization video very soon thank you for watching guys thank you thanks a lot